Our internship program here at Beachwood has uh, definitely evolved over uh, many years. Now we really focus on three main things. Um, students getting career exposure, um, students getting um, networking, and then the third piece is those soft skills, employable skills. Right now I'm working at Suffern Landing Systems in Walton, Kentucky. And every day I meet with my mentor. They give me different projects to do and they include a variety of different things. My day includes, um, I'm in five different departments. I shadow the nurses, doctors. Um, some days I scrub into the OR. I've always loved math and science and that's typical. So I'm gonna be an engineer. Um, but I really, engineering is so broad, I had no idea what I wanted to specifically do. And so the idea of getting out into the actual workforce and seeing these different kind of jobs was um, awesome and it, it's worked out great. I was relatively undecided on what specific major I wanted, but uh, I knew I wanted to get into business. And immediately hopping into internship with Brit, I knew I wanted to be an entrepreneur right away. This is your chance to try something out, to see a career in the real world. Get exposed, get outside of you know, Beachwood um, and meet adults and interact with people that you don't know. You only have to go five hours a week. It's not like this big commitment, but really just the experience you gain from it and not just like um, figuring what you want to do. That's a big part of it, but the personable skills and how to work in a work environment that's not school or your local restaurant that you work at. Um, to get that kind of experience in high school is huge and I can't state enough how much I've learned just from working with adults and being in that kind of environment. I feel like I was able to really test my boundaries so being able to see how like the nurses, doctors and like seeing all like gruesome stuff I realized like how I can get comfortable with all that stuff and how I'm looking forward to it in the future. Our intern right now, his name is Chris. He's experienced um, writing agreements watching us negotiate agreements, forming companies. He's gone to court before with one of our attorneys. He's um, sat in on real estate closing transactions. So he's had an opportunity to experience a lot of different business. I wasn't 100% sure. Now I'm dead set on being an entrepreneur from here on out. I feel like you should always put yourself out there. I feel like specifically to me like being able to talk to like a charge nurse and asking her to put me in the OR today it really just helps me put myself out there and I've made so many friends and I've made so many connections that it's really beneficial for my future. I would definitely just take a leap and do it. You never know until you try and getting exposed to it now instead of waiting later it, it puts you ahead of the game so much. It's a great opportunity for us too to see what the talent pool looks like going forward um, engaging people in a potential career that they may not have considered. Kelly and my, my wife and I look at this as, as a way to change the trajectory of, of young people. And it's just been really, really rewarding. So I think Quinn hopefully will look back at this as this is like the building blocks of things and, and the way he approaches college and college and beyond and maybe hopefully starting his own business. And so to have that impact, whether in a specific, specified field or being an entrepreneur is, is priceless. I think anybody who kind of cares about the development of young people in, in general, if, if you have any of that curiosity or passion, then, then you should be involved.